Hello guys, what a blessed morning. Today I'm gonna be making the XP system. Uh, it was requested by a subscriber that like watched the video of how to make the bot 24/7 uh, online. So uh, he had some problems, so he contacted me and he loved my video. He told me he wants the XP system. So here we go, and let's make it. We'll go through the wastelands, through the highways. Okay, guys, so here we are in Visual Studio Code. So, first of all, we need to make a new, fo a new f sorry, file, not folder. File, we will name it xp.json. And we will put those in here, okay? So back to our main uh, file, we will type here const xp file equal require brackets then put in those in here, wait one, put in those then dot slash xp dot json. So here, whenever I type xp file, it will connect to this file right here, xp.json. So when I type, let's when I type like that, xp file, it will connect to the uh, xp.json file okay cool really cool so now going to our big code right here all the code will be down in the description in the github okay so first of all we will have this right here uh, var add xp equal math.flow brackets math dot random brackets then multiply then five this means let me make a note to everyone okay god this uh, mean that uh, whenever whenever I type uh, add XP uh, it will randomly Choose a number between oops between like that. I guess one T. Yeah, one T. Between uh, one and five. Why five? Because I put here five. If I wanted more, I will make ten. So. Let's put like that, 10. So, let's this in here, to let you guys know what are we talking about. Like that. So, it will be this part right here. Let me take it like that. And put it in here. And whenever the 10 change, this 10 will change also. That means that if this is 2, it will randomly choose between 1 and 2. Okay, I guess this is enough. And going on in here. This code will let us make the... Like, the start. Every, every one starts with 0, zero XP, level 1. And Rick XP, uh, it is equal to required xp so level 1 is 100 xp okay so let's type here level 1 uh, let's say uh, statics uh, I guess like that I don't really know so that's it if you want level 1 to start with like 200 xp You'll just have to change that to 200, but I like it 100 is more simple, anyways. 
this is here to catch errors catch errors come on to this to this part okay so this one right here it will subtract XP okay so it will how will it subscri uh, subtract XP it will subtract XP by like every lever you pass you pass it it will like uh, subtract your XP like if you are level 1 you, and you finish the 100 XP when you are level 2 it will tell you like it will start from 0 it will not start from 100 again you know so it will start you from 0 so let's type in here it will subtract uh, XP when whenever let's type like that you pass a lever mm. okay cool so this right here will increase like the XP like if level 1 was 100 so level 2 will be 200 if I change that to 1.5 it will be 150 like that like if level 1 is 100 you will just need to multiply by the number in here this number so if it's 1.5 level 2 will be 150 if it was 2 so level 2 will be 200 I guess this is pretty much easy to understand so let's make a note right here XP you need to increase oh increase I, like, I guess like that if level 1 uh, wait, well, I got some messages right there okay anyway let's continue it is 100 XP so level 2 will be 200 XP and let's put like that multiplied by and Thing this Put it right here okay so multiply by 2 okay because it will be multiplied by 2 like that pretty much easy right now okay moving on to the next one so this one it is the XP round like it's just the XP round XP per round like it will just change this one it's pretty easy just put it like that and here it add a level whenever you level up like it add one level when you level oops level up so like if that was sorry this one was two it will be like if you are level one it will make it plus two so you, next level will be three so just make it one because every level it just add one okay that was easy I guess if you have any problems you can contact me personally on the discord server link down in the description okay so here this one will send a message you are now level then you level then it will do the message after 10 seconds you can change it right here if you want it to be like five seconds it is like that because it is it worked like with the fin to seconds I don't know if you know that like it is the thing that is uh, smaller than the second anyways just let's type that note 
so this code will send like this, let's put one like this, you are now level from here, you and like that then it will delete it after 10 seconds Second. oh like that okay and here as seen as you all know cashiers So this one, it's like, let's type a note, if someone typed in chat uh, equal level, it will, like, it, it will make an embed, it will make a embed. Uh, and this is what will be inside the embed actually like the title it will be level card set color the color will be green then the level the XP and the required XP okay so now let's try it out terminal new terminal node dot Okay, now let's go to our test place and anywhere uh, here let's type equal level as you can see right here level card have everything when I tap equal level it choose number between 1 and 10 and it was 8 so let's spam a little bit to level up mm -mm -mm -mm. more level. yep as you can see right here you are now level 2 and we will wait 10 seconds this should be deleted and voila it is deleted and if we go right here, as you can see, the data is saved right here. Like, if I deleted this, if I made like that, okay. When I go right here and type level, it will be zero, like start from the beginning. I don't know what is sent twice, but as you can see right here, level one. That's why. Okay, so that was it for today's video, I hope you enjoyed, don't forget to subscribe, like, and if you have any problems just contact me personally on the Discord server link down below, so that's it, see you in the next video.